and welcome to my kitchen and today is Thursday it is December the 8th and I just thought I would come and I had a couple of things I wanted to talk about a little bit of housekeeping channel wise and I don't know how many of you have noticed but at the end of the videos I've been asking you if you are already subscribed to go ahead down and next to the subscribe button click on the little bell this is going to um, solve some problems. There's a little something going on in YouTube land, and it's called the unsub bug. Now, this is something that's been going on since 2012, evidently, and I've been learning about it a little bit. Maybe you have some channels that you love that you got unsubscribed to, and you have no idea how that happened. Maybe you didn't hit the unsubscribe button. Maybe you just don't know how this came to pass that one day you just happen to notice hey I'm not seeing so-and-so's videos in my video feed anymore and I wonder what's going on on a regular basis I get emails comments private messages going I'm so glad to see this video of yours I was missing you for a long time it's good to see you re-uploading again I never stopped uploading I have uploaded on a regular basis Monday Wednesday Friday for at least the last four years on that regular schedule. Before that, I was uploading quite often on a regular basis. But if you notice that you're not seeing my videos in your video feed, it is not because I stopped making videos. It is very, very seldom that I will skip a day, very seldom that I will deviate from my Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. Sometimes life gets in the way and I can't help it, but that's not very often. So. If you go down below the video uh, player and there see the subscribe button next to my channel name, there's a little bell. Click on that bell and you will get a notification via your email, via your cell phone. It'll be one of the messaging systems and you'll get a notification whenever I upload a video. Additionally, if you don't have a smartphone, if you don't have an email, well, I mean, you're going to have an email, but if you don't want to get my messages that way, then you can subscribe to my newsletter, and I will be starting a regular notification every time I upload a video. I will be sending out a message through my newsletter mailing list and let everybody know that I have uploaded this video and give you links to where you can go watch it. Another way you can always be sure to see videos that I'm uploading is to follow me on my Facebook page, which is Noreen's Kitchen on Facebook. I also have Twitter, Instagram, Google+, I have Pinterest, which I'm not the best at posting over on Pinterest. I will be honest with you. I'm trying to get better. That's all I can promise. But I always push notifications of my new videos across my social media. And I also post, usually post blog entries that correspond with my video uploads. So across the board, there should be a lot of ways for you not to miss out on any of my uploads. So I would really appreciate it if you would hit that little button, the bell button, so that you won't miss out on any of the uploads that I share. During December, I'm trying to upload daily leading up to Christmas because I really feel like that's important. We've got a lot of things going on, and I want you all to have the best holiday season ever, the easiest way ever. So I have a lot of things that I'm trying to do to help your life be easier this holiday season. With that in mind, I just this minute finished watching a video from Catherine over at Do It On A Dime, and she also has another channel called Do It On A Dime Family, and I absolutely loved her video because she was talking about when it sucks, when you suck at momming. And I could not relate with this more. And I know that every single one of you moms out there and dads too, you know we have days when we just don't get it together. Her whole message was, she said, if you asked, her son's preschool teacher, or if you told her son's preschool teacher that she did home organization videos for a living, her teacher would probably, the teacher would probably laugh at you because she seems to be so disorganized lately because they've just moved into a new home. She had a new baby about six months ago, and life is changing for them. So 
organization is probably not at the top of her priority list. She's just getting it done the best way she can. And she did this whole video while she was curling her hair in front of the mirror. And I really love that because um, this time of year especially, um, people can feel less than. They can feel like they are completely imperfect, like they suck at everything, like nothing that they touch goes right. Like just yesterday I did, you know, I made a video for you guys and um, halfway through I thought this is going to be a disaster. But it ended up being fine. But you know, we all have those moments of self-doubt and I mean, even I do. So when Catherine mentioned that her pre the preschool teacher would think it was a joke that she was a home organization guru, let's say. You know, I, I totally get that because I present you guys with all sorts of recipes and, and great stuff from the kitchen, right? I'm not going to lie to you. There are days when my family eats breakfast cereal for dinner. There's not one of you out there that can't relate to that because some days just get away from you and sometimes we eat a late lunch which means nobody's hungry for dinner, which means that by nine o'clock at night, everyone's sitting around going, gosh, I wish we hadn't eaten lunch so late. Mm -hmm. Because you don't wanna eat dinner at nine o'clock at night. So then you're eating a bowl of cereal. There is no shame in this. And you know, it's about time that all women, especially moms, parents, not just women, let's, let's stop being judgy. Let's. Let's start propping each other up instead of tearing each other down. I know that it's, this world is already hard enough to get through, and I really feel like this message resonated with me, and I want to thank Catherine for presenting it because it was real, it was raw, it was honest, it was from the heart, and I really just felt very strongly about it. So I'm kind of conveying that message to my audience to say, let's, uh, let's not be upset with ourselves or ashamed with ourselves and let's not tear ourselves down. We are our own worst critics, right? There are people who are not judging you. You're judging yourself worse than most other people are because you in your head probably have this lofty idea of what you need to live up to and you need to stop thinking like your mother. Okay? You need to stop trying to achieve everything because sometimes you just can't. And you know what? Your family loves you anyway, and it's all good in the end. Sometimes we have to go to bed with dirty dishes in the sink. And for any of you who know me, that is not very often, because I have a Monica complex, and if you watch Friends, you know what I'm talking about. So today, I just wanted to come to you really quick. I wanted to talk to you about the little bell, the unsub bug, and because of what Catherine said, I was inspired to also present a very similar message. So, you know, if you have a YouTube channel and you have been touched by that message, and if that message resonates with you, why don't you present that message to your audience as well in whatever way you can? You know what? We're all just doing the best we can every single day. And that sometimes just has to be enough. So, if you don't have time to do certain things at the holiday season, you shouldn't feel guilty. You should just do the best that you can, and it's all going to be fine. So take that for what it's worth. Um, if you have to eat a bowl of breakfast cereal for dinner tonight, guess what? Your kids aren't going to care. They're going to think it's pretty cool, especially if they're little, that they get to eat a bowl of breakfast cereal for dinner. It's really all right sometimes. So... You know, my husband does that too. So it's okay. It's, it's just, just no big deal. So do the best you can. Please go hit that bell and so you'll get a notification. If you want more information on how to subscribe to my newsletter, it's always in the information box below, along with all of the links to all of my other social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, Google+, you name it. My blog is down there too. My website is down there too. Go ahead and check it all out if you haven't had an opportunity, and I will just love you for it. So hit the bell. Don't go hard on yourself. Prop others up, and have a great holiday. I'll be back tomorrow with another video. It's Tarani Pie Day. I can't wait to share. I'll see you then. See ya.